Hi, I'm Joe Dematti of the Ask the Pharmacist Group. Thanks for joining us once again on our Health Minute. Do you enjoy life? I don't know what age you might be as you view and listen to this video, uh, but here's some statistical evidence of a recent study. It showed very clearly that when men and women were evaluated as they hit their 50s, 60s, and 70s, in two-year increments, the number of episodes of significant enjoyment or general sense of joy in their lives, that was, it was directly associated with lower mortality over those two-year spans. Three different occasions, two, four, and six years. And what we also found is that folks that showed and displayed much less sense of enjoyment out of life, there was a higher mortality. So we saw an inverse relationship. Folks that had greater sense of joy, enjoyed their life, found joyful uh, type scenarios in their lives, lived longer. I, I, I don't know how else to say that to you. If you found no joy in life, if you could find nothing that caused you to have an expression of thankfulness and joy and appreciation for life, the propensity for you to die within those two-year time frames went up dramatically. Find enjoyment in life, find a purpose in life, invest yourself in that purpose. I would personally tell you that from a biblical perspective, there's no way that we can find joy and fulfillment in a new boat or in a new trip. Um, I, I think only true joy comes from inside. If you don't read a Bible, I would encourage you to do so. Begin in the Psalms. Begin in the Gospel of John. Uh, there's something about reading the Scripture. The Bible says that faith comes by hearing and hearing by the Word of God. It begins to build your inner man. It builds up your spiritual man. You could be a non-spiritual person. I'm okay with that. It doesn't matter. But I'm telling you clearly, if you cannot find a sense of purpose and joy in your life, the propensity as you age to die sooner significantly goes up. God bless you. Thanks for being with us on this Health Minute. See you next time.